One is an incident, two is a pattern, and three is a problem. Kirby Smart is in trouble with Georgia's football program. Not after Jalen Carter's misdemeanor charges of racing and reckless driving were arrested and tied him to the high-speed car crash that killed Georgia footballer Devin Willick and recruiter Chandler Leckroy. Cannot be denied. Too many people in the Georgian football program pay attention to the wind when behind the wheel of a car. Police said Leckroy's blood alcohol level was more than double the legal limit for him and he was driving a Ford Expedition leased by the Georgia Athletics at 104 miles per hour while hitting the 40 miles per hour speed limit. It is said that it collided with according to the athens clark County Police Department, Leckroy drove Carter and was driving in the wrong lane when the car changed lanes, overtook other cars, and tried to pass each other. Carter has starred in successive national championship team defenses for Georgia. He returned from NFL scouting his combine and was released on bail to face a warrant. In his statement, Carter said he expects to be exonerated. The future of Jalen Carter, NFL teams have to weigh pre-draft arrests against Jalen Carter's talent, says former GM Rick Spielman the fatal car crash continued the pattern of high-speed, dangerous driving initiated by Smart's football program. Georgian football has issues that prompt Smart to be more than just a sympathetic spectator. Smart 2. A car crash occurred on January 15 at 4.45 a.m., killing Leckroy and Willick and injuring athlete Warren McClendon and recruiting staffer Tory Bowles.